I hope you remember that you cannot repeat these experiments, but you can watch them. This is RAM from old computers. And you know what it has? All these contacts are covered with gold. For removing gold we need these scissors, which we carefully cut fingers with gilding. We got this tag. Pour all of this into deep glass and put nitric acid. In order to make a reaction less brown, we pour more water. After some time on the surface we can notice gold flakes. All this because under gilding context there is a copper. And when acid is dissolved, then gold is getting apart from fingers. When acid is dissolved and process is slowed down a little, we put the glass on the stove, so it will make a reaction more active. Meanwhile we got a blowtorch and using it separated gilded contacts with other sides of a ram. Only a little, so it won't go waste. So our reaction is over. All gold got rid of from fingers and taking paper filter we pull acid to other container. Now pour fingers with tape water. Actively shake it and right away pour in other glass. Repeat the process until we transfer their old gilding. When gold settled, we leaked water, so we don't need it anymore. Now we gotta take about 20 milliliter hydraulic acid, pour gold, and add their drops a little bit of nitric acid. Because its success will bother it in the future. In this mixture gold is dissolved and we add contacts which we got it with a blowtorch. In the end filter all of this through with a funnel and cotton filter. All excess left on the cotton. Add distilled water to mixture and evaporate twice, like we did it in the previous episode with watches. Meanwhile, dissolve metal vitriol in distilled water. Carefully heated two solutions on sand. After this, put them together and actively mix it with a glass stick about few minutes. In the end, we get black sludge gold, which we dry out and put it on the parchment paper. Using it, we could press this sand to a small pill. That we put it to a familiar brick. You already guessed what we are going to do. Melt our gold. Don't forget to heat this piece a parameter, so it won't crack. And then we are going to heat our gold sludge. It melted to the small bead, which we wait right now. Last time a lot of people got sad that we didn't mention the price of a gold that we got. In the previous episode we got about $27. This time only 3 bucks. We aren't gonna sell it. I'm not sure about Ukraine and US, but in Russia selling gold that you extracted by yourself is prohibited. Be careful so you don't need to recall life hacks from Russian prison. <laughs>